Hello everyone, welcome back to this episode of Display Calibration. Today I'm going to do something different. I'm not going to show you guys any calibration settings for uh, Display TV, but I'm going to show you guys the calibration settings for this little guy, the Samsung Galaxy S A+. I haven't got my hands on the S9 yet, but I hope I can. And why I'm the reason why I'm calibrating this, show you guys the calibrations, is because this this phone has some advanced features that you guys can take advantage of, and actually will help you enjoy most of the viewings that you guys see. All you guys got to do is go to the settings, go to the display. Let me see if I can show you a little better like this and once you guys go to the settings on the display you guys are going to go to the screen resolution here make sure that it's all the way to the maximum right there to the maximum then go to screen mode and on screen mode you guys are going to see that usually samsung has a amoled amoled display here it has a amoled cinema amoled photo or basic if you guys go to AMOLED display, I already checked the calibration for that, and it's quite off. It's not really calibrated. Um, they try to imitate, but as, as long as you don't calibrate, it won't be able to work. Uh, just go to the adaptive display, guys. That way it's going to allow us to, to get to the advanced features. And over here on the bottom, usually when you guys have it, it should be in the middle. Move it all the way to the warmth. At the beginning, you might think that it's um, that it's actually a little too yellowish, but once you get used to it, like most people, the thing is that most people are used to seeing too much blue, thinking that it's white, and or that's what is considered super white. But this is more natural to the to the reflective um, of the sun, not direct sunlight, but reflection uh, reflective light from the sun, bouncing light. Then you just go to the advanced options and the, on the advanced options, leave red all the way to the right and green is almost at the middle, but it's a little bit lower than the middle. Just move it right there to the one below the middle point and blue all the way down. Why? Because even though blue is all, is all the way down, I put it here and I, and I put warmth all the way high, still blue dominates the most on this screen. It's an AMOLED, but it's still the blue dominates a lot. This way, guys, is gonna show, it's gonna help you guys enjoy movies um, uh, from Netflix, movies that you download, YouTube HDR looks amazing in it, a lot better. And this TV, and this uh, not TV, this phone shows very good HDR for a phone. That's it, guys. If you guys go to the to the screen edge color balance, you guys can change it all the way to warmth, but it's gonna take about five to ten minutes. But it, there's nothing else to add. And once you guys are done, that will be it. Hope you guys enjoy and see you next time.